Namaste. I am Anjan. Here I am going to show you some very easy breathing and some meditation techniques which help you for your better health and mental health. Most of the time we are really thinking about our physical health. What about mental health? Very simple techniques if you practice every single day you can be very relaxed and stressful person. Especially these days, we all have different kind of stress and stress became mental uh, issues. So let's do very simple thing to release our tension and getting better mental health. Anyone can do this kind of breathing, this kind of meditation techniques. No matter you are 8 years old or 80 years old, it's good for everyone. You can do at home, you can practice in your office, whenever you are. You just need to keep your back straight and detach from everything. But definitely it will be good if you find some place quite quiet and no one disturbing you during that practice. Uh, for the breathing exercise, I strongly recommend you. Uh, it will be great if you practice open areas. In case if you are practicing at home, open the windows, get the fresh uh, air and practice it. So at first, keep your back straight. You can sit on the mat, what I'm doing right now. You can sit on the chair or uh, if you find it's too much for your knees sitting on the chair, mat, you can use your blocks. I'm using my blocks here, so I'll be much more. Um, my back will be straight and I, and I can sit here quite longer, long time and easily. So first breathing is super simple. Inhale five count, exhale eight count. Looks like inhale five, four, three, two, and exhale eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Try to make your exhalation longer than inhalation. I'm going to do here around six times. I suggest you close your eyes during this breathing. It's easy to focus. If you want to open your eyes, that's really okay too. But focus on your breathing. Let's start. Inhale. Inhale two. Inhale three. Use your nose, do not use your throat. Try to less create sound or zero sound. Around five to six times, if you want to make it even longer, if you want to make it more number of uh, times, this breathing, feel free. And then keep your right hand on your belly, left hand on your chest. Watch your right hand and your belly. You can feel when you are inhaling, your right hand going up, exhaling is going into your spine. Inhale slow. Exhale slower. Inhale slow. Exhale slower. In slow. Exhale slower. Just a couple of more times. Watch your right hand, watch your belly. This is a very easy way to bring your mind in the present moment.
release your hands. Drop your head down, slow and gently open your eyes. Let's do our next breathing. It's called alternate nostril breathing. Some people called Anulom Bilom, some people called Surya Ved Pranayam. So it's like more or less same. So what you have to do, inhale through your left side nostril, close, other side right, inhale same side, exhale left side. Well, once I'm showing you, it's easy to understand. Trust me, it's very simple. The reason is, once you do this breathing, so our two sides of our hemisphere will be balanced and easy to get rest, easy to release our stress. And it's very, very useful practice for better sleep and reduce stress. Again, no matter like what is your age, no matter you have any, like you have any special issues or not, anyone can do this. You just need to be a little bit more disciplined, disciplined person and need to practice every single day. You should start with five times and then you can increase 10 times, 15, 20 times. But definitely you should start from low number, number of times and then you can increase. So what I'm doing, going to do, right hand up, fold your index and middle, other fring, three fingers open, look like this. Close your right nostril, other hand on your knee. Watch my finger, I'm closing my right nostril, left side inhale. Close your left nostril, use your right side, fully exhale. Inhale, close, exhale, this is one, that means inhale through your left, close left, out right, inhale right, close right, exhale left, this is one round, very powerful breathing exercise. Let's do five times. And try to keep your mouth closed. As you're exhaling, try your best to make your exhalation longer than inhalation. Some of you can make it very long, some of you may not be. Well, we can start from eight, five and eight, and then we can increase our time. Let's start. Index middle, fold other three fingers open. As I mentioned you before, you can close your eyes, easy to focus. If you are opening your eyes, that's fine. Now, inhale, five, four, three, two, close. Exhale, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two. Inhale, same side, that means right, five, four, three, two. Close, out, right, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. This is one. Continue, please. It's two. Three. You can continue a couple of times. Five, six, ten, twenty, whatever you like. We're going to do our next one, next breathing, which is lying on the back. This kind of breathing you can practice any time, but best time in the morning and evening after sunset. We have many breathing exercises, but every breathing exercise, we should do the proper time. This one, in the morning or evening, usually this is the best time you can practice. Some breathing you can do only night time. So I'm going to do that. 
Before that, I give you some easy movement for releasing tension from neck. Most of the time, we are working too hard. Maybe you are using computer, maybe you are using phone all the time. So our neck are very tight. That's the reason our like neck and shoulders very stiff. We start feel headache and somehow we start to feel a lot of stress. So let's do some movement before we go for the next breathing. One block, make it flat. Second block here. So we are going to use this corner. Very simple and very useful. So lying on your back, this. Look at my block. I'm, my head rest, not really head, like the head and neck in between the junction. So resting on this uh, sharp part. If you find you are not feeling comfortable with your back, you, you have blanket or you can use your small towel, fold it or medium towel, fold it. Keep it under your lower back feel much more easier than normal so you are here you are allowed to fold your legs like this what I'm doing you are allowed to release your legs or butterfly legs but for me I want to bend knees it will be really relaxing for my back and my legs stay here for a few seconds or try to move your neck side to side one side center other side center. You don't need to hold too long and then slightly chin up, slightly chin down and again side to side. Our body is very smart. So once you do this one, your body will telling you exactly which part you have to stay a bit long or you have to press a bit harder. It's so simple but it's so useful. I strongly recommend you this one you should do before go to bed at night. So after this one you can if you go to bed it's easy to fall asleep. It's so so relaxing. You can practice this one two to three minutes. You don't need to do too long. Three minutes, four minutes, good enough. And then release your two blocks and then drop your head down. Release your block or blanket from your back. Our next breathing, we need one block. So keep your block on your belly. This time release your legs. If you want to use your small towel, so roll, fold your towel and roll this towel. Keep your towel under your head, like here. Block on your belly and then release your two legs, separate your legs around a feet. Look at my toes. If I lift my toes, that means my legs are very tense. I don't need to do that. Relax fully, knees facing up. Relax your hands, palm facing up. Soften your shoulders, soften your face. Close your eyes and focus on your breathing and especially focus on your belly and block. You can feel that when you are inhaling, your block going up as you exhaling is going down. Now coming two times, I'm not giving you any instructions. Focus on my block. You can see clearly the movement. I'm not focusing, I'm not forcing anything. But still my block going up and it's going down. It's so natural. If you focus on your block, this is kind of meditation. This is kind of easy way to release tension, easy way to get stress-free life. I'm starting three to two times.
I hope you can see my block movement is going out and slowly going down. The funny thing is, once you practice it longer, you can see the difference. First few times, the block will be moving quite fast. As you are staying longer, it's getting slower and slower and slower. I strongly recommend you if you are suffering from insomnia, that means you can't sleep, you should do this one your own, at home, on the bed, before you go to sleep. This is kind of meditation. Once you are focusing on your block, it's part of meditation. After this, you can release your blocks, keep your two blocks, one block under your head, one block under your legs, here, other block here. If you have yoga posters at home, you can use yoga posters at, under your thighs or just simply use your pillows, two pillows under your two thighs. It's so, so relaxing. And then I'm going to do Vamri Pranayam. We do have different kind of techniques. Sometimes we close our ears. Sometimes we don't do. So right now here I'm showing you the most easiest one. We don't need to do anything. Left hand on your chest, right hand on your belly. Relax your shoulders. Look at my legs. How relaxed. It is here that means very tense. It should be fully relaxed. And then need to inhale through your nose and exhale smoothly and need to create sound like black B. Like here. If you want to close your ears with your fingers, feel free. But again, I want to make it as simple as possible. That, that's why I'm using my hands on my body. Or just relax here. I'm going to do five times. During this five times breathing, feel the vibration which is coming from your face, your eyes, your nose, throat, chest. Again, all this breathing is super useful practice for your reduce stress. Once you are getting stressed in life, you are getting mentally strong and healthy person. And once you are mentally strong and healthy, every time you'll be very okay and no one can touch you emotionally. You'll be a very strong person. Everything will be very simple and smooth. So it's not only physical practice, you need to do some mental practice as well. This is part of that. Let's go. Inhale. According to your need, you can make this sound longer or medium. But make your exhalation should be longer than inhalation. 
and then we are going to do body scan meditation which is very simple lying on your back relax your two hands two legs to your body palm facing up at first focus on your right toes so try to bring your mind all the way down to your right toes watch your right toes try to find the color of your right toes the skin the shape how look like and relax and then your second toe other toes feel them relax them and relax your right ball of your feet right heel right ankle right shin right knee relax your right thigh right hip joint so relax your right leg fully from your big toe to your heel and same thing the other side start from your big toe finishing by your heel you can go up slow and gently take your own time then relax your two side up your hips your lower back mid back upper back relax your whole spine feel your mat where you are lying on the back time to bring your mind front side up your body so relax your lower belly relax your belly chest relax your two ribs relax your two shoulders relax your collarbones relax your right shoulder right upper arm right elbow forearm wrist palm fingers fingertips relax your left side starting from your shoulder arm elbow forearm wrist fingers as you staying there longer you can start to feel that your whole body getting so relaxed and kind of numb i hope you're not sleeping so try your best not to fall asleep during this breathing exercise and meditation techniques it's very powerful meditation is body scan relax your knee back of your knee the back of your head relax your throat chin cheeks nose lips eyes eyebrows relax your forehead finally bring your mind in between your eyebrows relax here i'm trying to give you instructions with faster once you're doing your own you can take it slower and longer it's no rush feel free to stay there once you have done slow and gently close your legs feel free to fold your legs turn your body one side and then up sit up sit nice and tall if you need block sit on your block if you need towel sit on your towel 
or just feel free to sit on your mat. Make sure your back is straight. Make sure your shoulders are relaxed. Here, I'm going to introduce another breathing, easy breathing and meditation practice for your own. This one you can do anytime, even in your office. You just need to sit tall again and simply count 60 to 0. Each second count 1 is reverse counting. This way you can bring your mind in present moment anytime. And I strongly recommend you do this meditation practice, meditation techniques at least two times a day no matter where you are. Start count 60 to 0, reverse count, like 60, 59, 46, 45, 26, 25, 24, 23, 22, 21, 20, 19, 18, 17, 16, 15, 14, 13, 12, 11, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Zero. Watch your breath. Drop your head down. Open your eyes. Last meditation techniques you can practice even longer. Or if you find 60 to 0 is too long, it's hard for you to maintain. You can start from 30, 30 to 0, and then increase the time, 40, 40 to 0, 50, 50 to 0, then 60. Once you practice regularly, you can make it maybe 120 to 0, that means 2 minutes. This way, you can increase that meditation techniques longer. I strongly recommend you, you should practice this one at least twice a day. I hope you learned some very easy meditation techniques and very easy yoga breathing, uh, which is helpful for your mental health. I strongly recommend you, you should practice every day, at least twice. If you practice every day, I'm sure within few weeks, you can see the result. So thank you so much for your time. Thank you so much for your patience. Stay healthy, stay safe, and always spread positive energy to everyone. Thank you so much and Namaste.